of child molestation praised state lawmakers for passing a bill removing time limits on when a child molester can be prosecuted. As Rob Masson reports, they say it will protect victims who are too traumatized to come forward. Victims of child sex abuse say it often takes decades to come forward in a legal system that seems intimidating. And we are fed up with the time because this is what they specialize in is pushing time back. What is that doing for survivors? Absolutely nothing. All it does is re-traumatize survivors. Previous state law required child molestation victims to press charges within 30 years of the offense. But some say that window wasn't big enough. Things are being looked at a lot different right now. I think the truth is starting to come out. With that in mind, state lawmakers voted on House Bill 453, which removes time limits for any victim of child molestation to bring charges. From its current 30-year statute of limitations to a no statute of limitations beginning on August uh, 1st, 2024. The measure passed overwhelmingly, but Fox 8 legal analyst Joe Respondi says the new law does not automatically clear the way for prosecuting child molestation cases, which occurred prior to August 1st of this year. I think that there's a possibility that once you have prescribed, your case is prescribed, meaning the statute of limitations has run out, it, it cannot be resuscitated. But moving forward, the statute of limitations is lifted for prosecuting child molesters and victims say the new law is welcome news. We are so happy to know that we have the powerful state of Louisiana that is finally stepping up for survivors here. And while the new law passed today lifts the statute of limitations for criminal prosecution of child molesters moving forward, victims like John Anderson are eagerly awaiting a state Supreme Court decision which could lift time restrictions for child sex abuse victims when it comes to civil lawsuits. That decision is expected soon.